kiss for you. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to this series. And in this video, this will be the part four of my video series on YouTube Data API using Android Studio. All right. So now we will continue from where we have left. So first of all, we will create an adapter because we need an adapter for our view pager because we want to show the two fragments inside our activity. So for that, we have to use adapters. So we have to use the adapter for the view pager. So I will create a new Java class, and I will name the class as adapter view pager. All right. Then what we have to do is we first of all have to extend it with the ex fragment pager adapter. So for this we can say extends fragment pager adapter. and there you can see we have the error and it is saying that we have to implement the abstract method get item so for this first of all click on alt enter and click on implement methods and there we have to override these two methods the first one is the get item and then the second one is the get count all right so here also we have to use the default matching constructor so there we have this and then first of all we have to use the two array list so first of all we have to use uh, let's say private final list of type string and we can name it as m frag or oh, sorry we can say fragment title list equal to new array list then we can say private final list of type fragment and here we can say fragment list all right and it is giving us an error that it might not have been initialized so we have to initialize it first so for this uh, and here we have the, uh, the 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 constructor and here we have to pass remove the non null then we have the fragment manager then here we have to add a list of type fragment and we can name it as fragment list all right and then we can simply say this dot fragment list equal to fragment list and then we can say okay so we have to write it below the super method and after this fragment list uh, we can say fragment title list dot add and here we can add videos and then we can add fragment title list dot add and here we can add playlist all right and then what we are going to do is here inside our get item method we are going to return the fragment list dot get and here we have to pass on the position and similarly for the get count method we can say fragment list dot size all right then there we have another method and that is the get page title and instead of this we can say return fragment list fragment title list dot get and in here we have to pass on our position all right so that is our fragment adapter view pager so now what we are are going to do is we are now going to write the code for our main activity so here first of all we have to use some of the variables or the you can say we have to create some fragments so here we will create a new java class and here we can name the fragment as video fragment and then we create another fragment here that will be playlist fragment so there we can say playlist fragment okay so we now have these two classes and here uh, first of all we have to create 
uh, the list of the fragments so for this we can say private final and here we can say list fragment and then we can say fragment list equal to new array list okay and then what we are going to do is we can use the adapter so we can say adapter view pager adapter or we can simply say adapter and then we can use the both fragments so first of all we have the video fragment and we can name it as video fragment then we have the playlist fragment and we can name it as playlist fragment all right after we do all these things then here inside our own career so first of all we have to do something for the toolbar so in order to do something i i mean write the code for the toolbar or set up the toolbar so we can simply say toolbar dot set title and here we can name it like youtube app and then we can say set support action bar and in here we have to pass on our toolbar object all right and then here we can say video fragment we have to initialize them then we can say equal to new video fragment similarly for the playlist fragment we can say playlist flag fragment equal to new playlist fragment all right we have these two then first of all we have to clear the fragment list so here we can say fragment list dot clear okay so if there in case if there is any uh, any data inside the fragment list so it will be cleared so after we clear it so now we have to add these two fragments so for this we can say fragment list dot add first of all we will add the video fragment and then we will add the fragment list dot add and here we will add the playlist fragment right now it will show us error because the video fragment is an uh, only a class so we have to make it fragment then this error will be resolved all right so for this after this what we can do is we have the view pager so we can say view pager dot set off screen page limit so it will set the screen page limit so since we have two fragments so we can pass on two here then we have to initialize our adapter so in order to initialize our adapter we can say adapter equal to new adapter view holder view pager sorry and inside here we have to pass on get spot fragment manager and then we have to pass on the fragment list so for the fragment list we can simply pass on our list here and then finally we can say view pager dot set adapter we have to set on our adapter here and there now we can use the set adapter method and okay so now what i want to do is if i select videos then the title of the toolbar should be the videos and if i scroll or swipe then the video then the title of the toolbar should be the playlist so in order to do that it's very easy so we can do it using view pager so here we have view pager dot add on page change listener so we have to use the own page change listener for our view pager then here we will be inside our own page selected so whenever a page is selected this method will be called and here we have the bottom sorry what was the name of our bottom btn view bottom navigation view dot get menu dot get item and here we can say dot set checked and we can mark it like true then here we can now check if i or if position if position is equal to zero it means that we have the video fragment so there we can say get spot action bar dot set title and here we can pass on videos then here we can say else if position is equal to one then we can say get spot action bar dot set title and here we can pass uh, say playlist all right then here after we 
clear everything from here let me see from where is the code okay so after this we clear up the view pager here i close it and here we now have to set use the set navigation item select listener so now if we click on the bottom navigation bars then this should also work so for this we can say button view dot set on navigation item selected listener new bottom navigation on item selected listener then here inside this on navigation item selected we have to use a switch statement and here we can check if item dot get item id so here we can now use some the cases of so here if we have r dot id dot menu or videos id we have to use break then we have case r dot id dot playlist id then we have to use break also and finally after this we can return true and in here if the case is video id then we have to set the current item to the view pager so for this we can say view pager dot set current item and in here we have to provide zero and we have to change the toolbar text so here we can say get spot action bar dot set title and here we can pass on our videos all right similarly for the playlist here we can say view pager dot set current item here we have to pass on one then here we can say get spot action bar dot set title and here we can pass on playlist all right so that was the code for our main activity it is now completed it but there are some errors like this these two errors of video fragment then we have some other errors as well where is the error okay so this this is the error which we have to remove so we will remove it in our next part of the video so guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe to my channel thank you and goodbye